So I've never seen this before. A goblin camp has spawned up on the top of our mountain that originally I wanted to colonize. Uh, so this is going to make things a little bit tougher because they've got a really good spot to attack us from. So we'll see what happens. I mean, we're probably going to satisfy them. It's just very interesting because usually uh, the plot of land that they do settle on, uh, at least in the forest region or forest location, uh, they usually have like, you know, it's usually like dirt or whatever. Um, but since they settle on this mountain, it's just kind of scattered all over the place. I mean, I think it's cool. Uh, it's very cool that they spawned up here. I've never seen, I've never seen this happen before, but uh, this might be a pretty big problem for us. Anyways, um, right now we're having some issues. For some reason, our hearthlings are not picking up our wood resources. Don't know what's going on there. I'm guessing that if I try to chop down a tree, maybe that will work. Maybe once they, yeah, chop down this tree, and I, 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 I don't know. I'm just, I'm just kind of throwing out ideas right now. Uh, that way, if they see more wood, they're like, oh, that's cool. Uh, we know how to put, you know, we know how to pick up wood now. I put a few more urns also inside of our warehouse because we are running out of uh, space like really fast. Um, oh yeah, well there you go. You should probably not do that there. Red spoon has achieved farmer level four. Don't put any food in here. Don't put any food in here. And this, uh, do we even have uh, a fourth urn? I don't know. Or I, I, I have no idea. Right now, our potter is just focusing in on, on making all these uh, these clay, uh, I apologize, these clay oil lamps because I only have like two and I need nine to give to him. I'm not sure when he's going to come back. I'm sure he's going to come back uh, come back at some point and I need to be ready to go or else uh, he is not going to be too happy with me. The Goblin King, that is. Uh, did this, so I'm guessing the ladder worked, right? Yes. So what I could do technically, yeah, and I, I think it would be easier. I'm not going to make my... my life any harder than it needs to be uh let's let's slice down well let's see where is this at uh oh crap okay so we need to go way lower than that let's splice all the way down and right there aha okay so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna dig out from here like i said i don't want to make it any harder because i don't want to continue to chop down a, a ladder and then you know, all this other stuff. I don't want to do that. So let's just have him dig like this. Let's see. We're at 14 uh, meters above mining zone. What? Mining allows you to... No, I want to, I want to do this. Uh, we're 14 meters above, I'm, I'm guessing, uh, rock bottom. The bottom level. Not rock bottom from SpongeBob. But, uh, or I'm sorry. The rock bottom from SpongeBob is more like... Pfft. No, no, no. It's... Pfft. Yes. Next bus to Bikini Bottom, please. Pfft. Um, this is more of like a, uh, I'm, I'm guessing it's kind of sea level. I, I don't know. I don't know. That's not sea level, but anyways, we're going to build out this way. I, I believe that yes, uh, our theory in, in part four of this series so far has been that if you dig further down, we will acquire more clay and stone resources. And I do believe that that is what we're seeing. Uh, there is quite a bit down here. So that's really positive. Okay. So anyways, uh, let's have them go and work down there. Very cool. Uh, you know, I'd love to kind of light up this this pit with with lanterns all over the place. That would be awesome. And also, I'm really disappointed with my farmers, man. Uh, both Red Spoon and Chief of Canada, you guys have been doing a a poor job at finishing off these these corn these corn resources. I'm pretty sure that we're gonna be running out of food food soon, especially with all these uh, all these citizens a part of our town. Okay, so uh, Isaiah got to level one blacksmith in blacksmithing. Oh, nice. Look at this bronze. Oh, but we don't have any ingots. Dang it. Well, we might find some while we dig down. I'm sure we will, actually. I'm pretty sure we will. So we already built the anvil. I should probably place that down, right? Yeah, just, just while I'm on the subject of it, let's go ahead and place the anvil down. So just put that right there next to it. Please pick this up at some point. So yeah, chopping down that, 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 uh, that tree tile, or that tree resource did not help once they found the wood because they're still not looting any of this stuff which there might be a reason that it is like there might be a, a reason for it I, I don't know maybe i'm missing something and maybe it's not a part of the game maybe it's not a mistake of the game it's maybe it's a mistake of my own a human error wait a second are these the farmers i was about to lose i was about to lose it i was about to lose it if the farmer was just standing there swinging his arms i was like come on dude you gotta you gotta be doing the corn, man. You gotta be f f planting corn. How are we doing in terms of net worth? Okay, so this will probably be one of our last uh, daily updates where we receive a, a new hearth lane. Let's go ahead and make sure that we name them now. Okay, so uh, for this one, I'm going to use... 
uh, awesome face mat. These pretty good stats there. Six three four, very cool. Okay, let's speed it up here, and hopefully we get all these resources back because they've got to go all the way back to the warehouse. And again, I would have loved to have you know been building the second warehouse by now, but unfortunately, you know things have uh, occurred that has made me kind of change my priority. I wasn't expecting a goblin camp, especially not here either. But I wasn't expecting a goblin camp. I guess I should have been expecting a goblin camp because it's day 18. Iron veins. Okay, so we can acquire iron if we wanted to. Yeah, we're not going to get any ingots if we don't dig inside of the mountain. That's one reason why we maybe should go after the mountain. Let's go and loot this. Maybe if we loot some items that uh, we, ac we actually need, or like items that actually should be should have been looted, uh, looted a while ago, maybe that'll help. Or probably just restarting the campaign will probably help as well. But, uh, but we'll see. And maybe we should grab a, a little bit of silkweed, even though we don't have a weaver. Just send them over this way, as it is. I shouldn't be sending them over towards anywhere close to the goblin camp. You know what I should also should do? You know what? Wait a second. Bam. Problem fixed. Problem has been averted. Oh my goodness. Yes. I, I, yes. I'm pretty sure that is going to completely fix the problem. They're going to attack us, but they're just going to stand on the side of the mountain. Because once we remove these th this ladder... I mean, of course, we will ne would never be able to get to the mountain again. <laughs> uh, unless, of course, we build a ladder from here to here, which I, I technically could. We could, farm, uh, we could far farm goblins. Bam, look at that. Problem averted. We don't even need to worry about those guys. That is cool. We'll see if that actually works. I don't know if it will. I'm really, I think it will. There's no way they can get down now. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay, that, <laughs> that is awesome. That is really cool if this ends up working. Okay, so what's going on with our tunnels? Very nice. You know, it would be really good to probably place more items down this way. And I should probably just put anything down here, huh? Well, do I have more chests to, to place? I do. I've got three more. All right, then I'm going to do it. We are just going to continue to dig a little bit more. And, uh... Yeah, no, I think that's a good idea. Let's Let's... Let's make sure that we branch this thing out. Where's mining at? Press, there we go, M. Okay, so let's just go ahead and keep on digging. I mean, a lot of our hearthlings aren't even doing anything. We've got a lot of citizens in this town. So I don't see why we shouldn't do this. Well, I think everyone's eating right now. It's about that time of the day. But uh, but good, yeah, people are already running down there. Perfect. So we should be pretty much good to go in terms of clay and, and stone for a while. Oh, this guy wasn't even building, working on bricks. I've only got 27 resources of clays uh, of clay, which is okay. Build me 30 more, because I know that whenever I, I end up building the warehouse, I'm going to need a lot of bricks. And let me make sure that I also have nine clay land. Actually, I don't need to give it to them. Aha! We didn't even need to build that. So we're fine. We are in an excellent spot. Let's go ahead and boost it up to speed to here. They're working a little bit slow, which I do not like. Uh, so how is our warehouse? I uh, We do not have another urn. Let's make sure that we build that now because it's going to bother me if I, if I don't build that. I'm pretty sure that's what happened. So I'm guessing this is not showing us that we... I'm guessing we aren't... We're missing these wood resources from our inventory, if I check. Ah, see, just those items are not being picked up. It's just these items because everything else that we've looted, that it's been placed into... Uh, our chests. Hey, what the heck? I've got this stuff. Oh, it doesn't matter. I wasn't going to give it to him anyways. Well, that's very strange. You dumb folks no make my stuff. Doom, doom to all. All right, well, we'll, we'll see about that. Hopefully the wolves also spawn up on this mountain. That would be great. The wolves are a little bit more scary. Wow, this is awesome. Look at this. Everyone is eating. This, this dining hall is... It's, it's a beast. It's crazy. How are we doing here? 24, 18 resources. We still really need it to... Wait a second. Level 3 farmers can upgrade can be upgraded to a, a cook, right? I thought they could. Uh, let me go ahead and check here. Can... Well, let's check on Chief of Canada first. I think he might... If, anyone, if anyone's going to be ahead, it might be him. Chief of Canada was the first 
farmer that I hired. Yes, I could hire someone. I can't hire someone to be the cook. I don't know if we're really, really ready for that right now. Uh, I'll probably do Red Spoon because I know Red Spoon loves to be the cook. So let's go ahead and do Red Spoon as the cook. We are going to need another farmer though. Let's go Awesome Face Matt as the farmer. Actually, we're going to have to wait. And actually, it probably shouldn't be Awesome Face Matt. Let's, let's do someone that's been around for a while. Let's use Tom Clark here. Uh, yes. Well, whenever he places down the farmer's hoe, which he really needs to. Well, you know, all the items are pretty far away anyways. It's going to take a while. Okay, well, whenever I remember it, I'll, I'll rehire everybody. But let's, let's exit this window for now. And how are we looking into our tunnel system? Looking good? Yes, you guys are really digging fast. I love how fast everyone's digging. Let's keep on going, though. I want to I want to dig a little bit further. This this is looking nice. I mean, we can do a lot down here. We can build a, our whole city down here if we wanted to. Yeah, this, this village is is really starting to look uh, pretty cool. I think. So I'll fin I'll wait for them to finish up this all this, uh, and at that point, well, let's see if we can hire someone as the farmer now. Uh, enough time, I think, has might have might have gone by. Yes. Okay. So Tom Clark will be. Uh, the new farmer, because we always need two. So I'm thinking we need, uh, you know what? We probably don't need a second warehouse. You know what? Because I was thinking about building a second warehouse down this way, but because, I mean, essentially, the tunnel system is going to be doing the same thing. Uh, it's it's going to be providing a source for resources. I guess it's going to be an area for resources that are that's in the southwest corner of our village. So I don't technically need any more. Do we have, have we built, am I having anyone build any more chests? Because I probably should. We should be building a lot more chests down here. Okay, well, we will do one there. How much is this stuff being filled up? See, the cool thing is that that's why that's, it's going so fast. And they're working so fast down this way. Because they don't have to move very far to, uh, to, to place all the items that they're discovering. Okay, so bam, just like that. We'll probably go something around like that, I'm guessing. Whoops. Yeah, that's that's cool. So continue to dig out. Uh, let me make sure that I build... I'm just building, like, stone chests everywhere. Oh, oh, invaders. All right, okay, I didn't spot those. We have a caravan, but I don't, I don't really care about that. Okay, well, get out of my face. Get ready for the invaders. There's two of them. Hopefully they, hopefully they spread apart. Ah, the fact that they're two together is really bad. Now, before I forget... Because I know I'm going to forget after I, I'm fighting these guys. Let us let us make sure that we uh, begin to make... Well, uh, well, there's nothing really we can make here because we haven't found any ingots. So we have to just start to mine the tunnel, which I guess I should start doing. Uh, no, I need to go to Mason. I'm sorry. All right, Mason. Uh, you're not really working on anything anyways. We've got stone resources. Build me like 10 of these, honestly. You've, we've got 20 resources, so build me 10 chests. Yeah. Cool. Okay, so now let's watch over these. Uh, let's watch over these skeletons. So this is really not good because they are together like that. Uh, so if they ever find just one hearthling, they will probably kill it. They'll probably kill it, whoever they find by themselves. If you remember the hotkey for this? It's R. That's right. Okay. Okay. So let's see where they're going. They might be going. I don't know if they're going to be going towards the pits, which actually would be, I think, worse. Oh gosh. Now we have a thief. Oh no. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, it spawned from the camp. Okay, so these guys are together. We might have a little bit more luck there. Come on. We've got 3v2, three, three which isn't really the best scenario. Uh-oh. This might be really bad. Okay, run away for a second. Wait for more. Wait for backup. Wait for, wait for the reinforcements. Good. They're, they've been spread apart. Uh, this is a little bit scary. Okay, we, we got it. Now now they got it. Okay. Yeah, that was, uh, that was a little bit scary. Because they were so close together, they were using kind of the walls to their, to their benefit. I, I didn't realize that there were so many hearthlings around. That could have been really, really bad. Yeah, that could have been really bad. Okay, let's double check down here. Uh, you have not finished digging at all, did you? Yeah, no one's finished anything yet. I'm guessing there's been no stone, uh, no more stone chests, I'm guessing, either. Probably not. Yeah, no, nothing just yet. Okay, well, let's let's head back up this way. Let's head back to the top. Figure out what we're seeing up this way. Still, farmers have not began production of the, over the corn crop. The second corn plot of land. 
How's everything looking in here? It's looking fine. Uh, we should definitely consider, because it's probably taken a very long time for our hearthlings to get around back and forth, uh, but we should just kind of consider a pathway. Pathways would be pretty smart. It's just going to be a little bit more difficult, especially to get from getting over to the kitchen. Or the, the dining hall, I should say. We're going to have a kitchen, because I think that's what I'm going to build here. Or maybe here, next to the graveyard. Probably not next to the graveyard. Well, I mean, it wouldn't be that bad. I want it to be somewhat close to the kitchen, though, so that they can get to these resources quickly. Yeah, that's, that's what we should do. But again, like I said, I'm waiting for everyone to finish uh, up mining the tunnels. Let's go ahead and double check again. Uh, yeah, no one's really working on it right now. I mean, I guess it, that makes sense. I mean, it's nighttime, so I mean, what do we expect? Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and double check on this. Seems like it's running. The game's running a little bit slow. There we go. There's our chest. Okay, so let's let's throw it down. And good. So four should be enough down there. I really think 35 out of 64. The second place. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. There's only 30. I think there's only about 35 resources so far. So this isn't bad. Very nice. Now put all that stuff away. Okay. Much better. Okay, so now I, I want to make, I mean, maybe I should make just an entire professions building. The problem with the professions building, the problem with like just a building full of all the uh, professions in our village would be that the warehouse is all the way over this way. We probably would need this to be strictly like cooks and maybe like probably the potter since, since the pit is already here. So you might be able to do something like that. And what I think I'm going to do just to make things easier, because I don't want to slow down the game any more than it already is, is uh, I'll probably use a template build. I guess I could technically use the warehouse. Nice, Tom Clark, very good. Level one. Um, I'll probably use a template building and not build the items inside of that building. Well, place them down, but then I'll eventually, you know, take them away. I really love this structure here. This is my absolute favorite template that they've had. So I think that's what we'll do. If we can open up this, there we go. I, I believe it is the clay house for two. Yes. As soon as this, that yeah, I know that that's it. Oh no, that's that isn't it. There it is, clay house for. Oh okay, it is it. Okay, clay house for two. The pictures are all over the place right now. Daily update. I don't know if we're satisfying that. Uh, let's go about there, I guess. Maybe it should be, maybe there. Yeah, I like that. And let's just wait for this window to pop up with telling us we, yeah, that's it. That's all you need. Finish editing and we'll begin to work on that. I didn't realize we could, wait, technically, could we edit the templates now? Or can, I guess we could always have done that, right? I don't know. I, I think they're just now allowing you to edit the templates. I do not remember in the previous alphas being able to like, you know, uh, finish off maybe some of the win or maybe add more windows or take away windows. Anyways, they're going to be begin production on that, and then we're going to be able to hire somebody uh, in the next video. I I'm guessing that will probably satisfy the daily update. I don't know where the net worth is at. Yes, just barely. Wow, yeah, just barely. All right, guys, I'm gonna have to stop right there though. Thank you so much for watching, and I will name this person uh, in the next video.